Hello everyone, here we are for a Losers Battle 52 between Audible and Throwaway for the Final Fantasy Tactics 1.3030 AI Tournament for Season 4. Okay, so Audible's team, to present his team once again, on top we have BB the Monk, Phoebe the Monk, Rai the Samurai, and Trini the Key Mist. And if you can't tell, my voice sounds a little bit more crisp because I, I adjusted the mic settings a little bit so there's no rhyme it doesn't pick up laptop laptop noise as much but anyways now we have throwaways team which comprises nutrition the ninja peace the knight purity the blue dragon and life the living bone um <clears throat> maintenance on the knight it's a good thing for uh getting rid of making sure that breaks don't happen weapon breaks or armor breaks whatever but that's not really often this turn but anyways yeah and then this knight i like this knight a lot 14 speed uh, yeah, it's a pretty decent night. I mean, ninja, my bad. Um, okay, so we're gonna start off. We're gonna go to map two. Back gate of Lasalia Castle. This is where you, uh, meet Zalmo the first time, where you're in that, uh, battle with Alma as a guest. So here we are. Alright, to note, Audible is in the white, and then Throwaway is in the yellow with the monsters. Yellow ninja, yellow knight, blue dragon, living bone. Okay, nutrition. He's gonna go forward and cast 182 damage ice brand. Pretty good in his part. No stop proc from that Hell Ivy. I believe that was Phoebe who casted that. Yep, BB. She and Phoebe move be uh, move forward. Rai, he moves forward a little bit. Trini, they can't do anything. They don't have any ranged attacks, but not everybody does. Okay, Peace is going forward. Life. 100 damage. I think that there's compat issues amongst these two teams. And the uh, stop proc does go off, so pretty good for Trini right there. 84 damage. Another stop. Nope, no, no, no other stop proc. Haste. Double panel haste. Okay, that's pretty good for nutrition and uh, whatever the female knight's name is. Okay, magic shuriken takes her down and nutrition. Wow, he double turns the entire team. That's just a really freaking fast ninja. Okay, peace. She's gonna go forward. Um, uh, purity is the blue dragon. Yep, uh, charm. Charm, 40% misses. So if BB did not get her charm off chakra, she's gonna heal some of her health back and then just run away. Um, she's got move HP up plus regen, so she can heal a decent amount of health back with chakra combo okay so 150 from trini she moves forward demi uh well it doesn't hit the blue dragon so that's a good sign and no stop procs once again no refreshers okay trini gets ko'd once again and purity he's gonna go dash 308 critical pretty nice on his part so it looks like as if throwaway might win this round it ultimately depends uh, it looks like as a uh, BB, she might be able to win this. Yeah, charm, 37%. It misses. Okay, so BB, she's gonna go for a death sentence. I'm guessing a Demi's gonna be casted on Dragon Spirit. That's a good counter to death sentence. Okay, all right. So miss, uh, no uh, Demi onto uh, BB. Phoebe, she misses her. She misses her thing. Okay, so that's a little bit unfortunate. Nutrition finally gets a turn in, and he's gonna KO her. That's a pretty good uh, ninja right there, yeah. Tampons! Okay. Slowed her down because of the quick action, the lesbian action. Okay, so Purity, he's going to go for another dash. Alright, so 187 damage speed save. So that's pretty decent. Nutrition got KO. Life, he's going to go cast a death. And it misses. A 44% chance, I believe. Okay, so haste onto the monsters. Monsters get more turns in now. Okay, good. Okay, Rai is down the two HPs and critical. Charm, and it misses. So, unless he can... Um, I don't know. Audible could come back. It depends on how his monks. Yep, they're coming back now because they're constantly healing. Uh, it doesn't look like as if that knight has any... With Yeah, it doesn't look like as if any of those guys have uh, on Throwaway's team have resurrection capabilities other than that ninja. Because remember that knight, ha that knight has time ma uh, time magic, so she can't do anything. She can't resurrect. Um, that crystal looks a little bit buggy, but you can't help it. Okay, those monks are keeping everything alive. Um, it's still uh, a ways away from uh, completion, though. Okay. Okay, Trini gets KO'd once again. Uh, this is a, yep. Yeah. Tampons! Okay, another slow. Okay, um, I'm gonna give this round to throw away. I don't think those monks by themselves can handle these units. 
I could be wrong though. I think I'm running this at 150 frames per second, not 170 like the normal tournament standards are, so I apologize if it seems a little bit slower, the action. Okay, 79% from uh, Peace. She and both Life cast or get haste. Rai, the primary attacker, is down. Must you remember that? So now it's really up to these two monks and their resurrection. It's a th it's a three on three. So it, this is still anybody's game. All right, 150 X potion, pretty decent. Uh, Peace, she's gonna go for it. And looks like she's going for a slow, a double panel slow. All right, Purity, he's going for it. He's gonna cast a dash, not kill. Demi, my bad. And it does kill Trini, and it puts the other one in critical. And it looks like uh, Life is going to cast a death upon himself to get his HP back. And now it looks like Phobia is down. And he misses his 56% chance. Okay. And these guys are keeping up their res chain. That's what they're doing. And they're doing a damn good job out of that. Uh, job at it. Automo's holding up quite a bit, though. I mean, he's got his chakras and his move HP up and regen. So, I mean, this is a... I think it's still going to give... I think this is still game for a throwaway. I think he's taking this round. Audible can come back, though. It ultimately depends on how long those monks can tank, especially BB. She's got nearly all of her health. She's nearly at max health. It looks like an X potion is going to be thrown on. Yep. So almost all that damage from Purity is healed up. Yeah. These guys have great res uh, healing abilities, healing capabilities. Okay, so 100 damage, that's a pretty decent amount of damage, okay. Ice Breath on the Trini, she's KO'd, but that's not going to matter because she's going to get revived. If there could be like a triple panel Demi, like some AoE from the night, I think good can happen, but she only has 6 HP now, so MP, my bad. Oh, uh, just when, uh, what's her name, Peace needs that, she, only has, she's, she doesn't have any magic left. And Wish for 5 damage. What a retard. I, I never knew Wish could be used like that. Alright, um, you know what? The phone's ringing. It can go suck dick right now. I don't care. Um, yeah, so I apologize for that noise. Holy crap, it looks like stuff could be turned around. Okay, um, yeah, so decent amount of damage going on. Um, 209, another critical. 1 HP away from getting killed, I believe. Yeah, she was 1 HP. Lucky. Wow, this could be a turnaround though. I mean, with the charms and the amount of healing, it looks like as a throwaway, it can't do enough damage. And oh my god, that sucked. That really sucked. Death though, 33%, it actually works. So really good job on her part. The last bit of her magic was used for speed rune, so pretty good. But that chemist just brings it right back up. Oh my god. Audible could win this due to his ladies. His ladies are really just tanks. Surprisingly. Even the one that has power sleeve. That was an error, I think, on his part. I think he wanted that one to have a crystal helmet. And if the deaths could be casted on, that would be really nice. But they don't. Alright. So it's going to be down to these two monsters really soon. And I doubt they can do it, but we'll see. Okay, uh... BB got KO'd. Phoebe is just going to heal her up, though, with a revive. Okay, so Life is going to cast a death once again, and he's going to cast on the Phoebe. 49% breach, and it misses. And it misses, uh, Phoebe, that, uh, death. Okay, BB. Death sentence. Yeah, this is over. Wow, his ladies were able to just withstand. Um, throw away just, without the ninja, they can't do enough damage. Unless these, unless death um, procs can get lucky. Unless he gets lucky with death procs, I don't think it's going to happen. There's only one more turn left for that uh, blue dragon. Charm? Yep, charm, 36%. Wow, good turnaround by Audible right now for this round. Okay. Counter flood, stop. Oh, that's going to prolong the death, but no matter. Death sentence. It'd be funny if undead were immune to death sentence, but I don't think they are. Okay, so just being able to last um, helped out Audible a ton. And that uh, life, um, life's HP is all the way back up. That doesn't matter though. He's 
These guys are going to die any second. So, yeah, this was a good round by Audible, and that was glitched. The door shut. Oh, Death Sentence is... Death Sentence is a... Uh, it doesn't count. Oh my god. Ugh. Get, throw some X potions onto him. Oh no. Okay, well... Oh, the charm wore off. Alright. Alright, death! That blue dragon has yet to get a turn. Alright, now he dies. Okay. Life can turn this around. It ultimately depends. If he can hit death procs non-stop, he'll win. Remember that the AI is ignoring him because he's got death sentence on. Yeah, that was slow and ugly. That speed saves. Oh, re-raise! Oh, so oh my God! Wow, this is a uh, we're far from over. Ra revive, the casting revive. I've never seen punch art used like that. I, I know chakra heals undead units. All right, 120 speed save. I believe that's BB. Okay, well, one more hit onto that chemist. It's gonna be down to those two monks then. And with their limited move, they're gonna have to deal with these two. The blue dragon should go for a tail swing, but he's not. Alright, this is really interesting. Two on two on three. Okay. Counter flood stop proc does go off. The ladies themselves can't do enough damage because they only have bags. Okay. 78 damage has a risk. No stop proc from the Hell Ivy. Okay. BB. She's gonna go for a just chakra. To help uh, prolong, uh, make the fight longer. Dragon Spirit, so that dragon is not down for the count. Um, God, this is a long match. Jesus. There we go. Finally, I was looking for that tail swing. The RNG is in his favor now. Charm, 48%. Pretty good. Unfortunately, that living bone is not immune. And 12 damage from the tampon smack. Okay. Yeah, so... Yeah, I was saying that the living living bone's weakness is fire, not ice, so it doesn't matter. And he's only got ice soul, so he can't really heal his partner in crime. Death misses once again. Hell Ivy, pretty decent. Okay. These guys cannot do enough damage. They have to status each other to death. Okay, well, the living bone is down, so all that matters now is the blue dragon. Unless that living bone comes back to life in enough time before the dr blue dragon gets killed. Excuse me. Mm. Charm wore off on the blue dragon. Dash. No c Petrify! Alright, that was a nice finish right there. Okay, with that said, um, I'm going to be seeing you guys for round two. Um, see you in a bit.